What is up, everyone? Welcome to a really quick stream today. We're just going to knock out a couple of weekend league games here on Mother's Day. <clears throat> My mom finishes some stuff up before me and mom retire to go watch some Ozark early tonight. So hopefully we can get a couple of wins in. But before we do that... All right, guys, a little earlier than normal. The kids are still awake, even though one's got school tomorrow. I can hear them all clamoring in the kitchen for some fruit. So we're going to utilize this time to try and salvage some of this weekend league week. We are back to the problem of throwing lots of interceptions. So we focused the last game on not throwing interceptions. We won 28 to nothing. But that's not because we didn't throw interceptions on. We are set, ready to rock. Because we're playing against the runner. It's not a good guys runner. On your screen, ready to rock as well. Some of the stars in today's game. Speaking of the game, let's get right to it. All right. Yo, yo. Not the right play again. First down, Vic. Oh, he's gonna air it out. Wow. That was not the right play. I must have done something wrong with the abilities to take people off of man. There's two games in a row where I've done that on the very first play. You knew they wanted to get them involved. These are going to get the first play, though. I don't know what I clicked there. I must have clicked linebacker. Is that the linebackers to zone? And the decision to come out of the end zone is going to cost him five yards as he's taken down right at the 20. So much shedding that shouldn't be happening. Your mom is fading. Me. Come on, man. We're going to play this game right away. Bullshit ass linebacker fucking interceptions. Wide open in one more step. 
Yeah. Great job. That means the receivers have to understand that they bring up the routes quickly as well. Line of scrimmage, the 15. It's first and 10. Now here's Vic following the interception. He crosses his man, Jackson. That's been taken into just four second down. Play this game all day. Because of the draft route. And he ran a little shallow more than normal as he worked straight across the field. He was hoping he'd get lost behind the defensive line. But once he made the catch, nowhere to turn up field and gain any yardage. Good. Why? Why does my people not? Why do my people not intercept that? We're going to start off this way, guys. This is the way every game starts. There, guys. Backwards, overhand. Intercept shit with a fucking linebacker. My fucking safety doesn't even dive. I swear to God, man. I swear to God. How, how, I mean, I stepped up in the pocket. I'm just. This game is a piece of shit. I'm gonna make him quick snap and run in there. Thank you for wanting to make a tackle. My whole guy! Fuck this game! This game, I'm telling you, makes a decision at the beginning who they want to. You can say whatever the fuck shit you want. Two wide open people, two perfectly animated fucking interceptions, and then two fucking plays in which... The first one I fucked up. Then the second one, that shit. And then that bug. Let this, let's do this again. Run it again. The Browns drive about to get started. And it's 
Yeah. yeah, this guy now thinks he's a boss. So he's fucking running mid blitzes against me. So you don't want to let his fucking guy catch catch up? You're pretty sweet. These guys certainly need something good to go their way because this first quarter has been something of a disaster for them trying to move the ball. But that completion there, maybe can get them focused. And Look at that! That was on the fucking comeback route! Oh, there we go. Now I can have one. So, do you want to let Vic catch up to Graham? The Bucks offense set to begin their next possession. And last time, decent field position through the pick six. Obviously costly. But they can't afford to just bunker in there. Good field position means going over the top down offense. Try and press the advantage a little bit. They just have to be better with the football. I didn't bother you too much last time. No, because it's exactly what you're supposed to do. You can't have good field position not trying to take advantage of it. Sometimes the defense makes a good play, too. To throw on second and ten. Vic, oh, fires this one downfield for Chubb. It's incomplete. Took a shot. Couldn't get in. He was trying to get that one out to his running back out of the backfield, but that one was written time perfectly, and they were able to break it up. Now they face a third and ten after back-to-back -back incompletions. Play action, Vic. Here's Johnson with an exception. This one field across the 35. The kind of game he's had so far, you have to know that on third down, that they would be looking his way, and they did for big yardage and a first down. I think the defense fell asleep with the switch on that one. I would have doubled him, tripled him, anything to keep the ball in his hands. A first down throw coming for Vic. It's three. Those two have hooked up for a touchdown once already in this game, that time unable to find a completion. Yeah, it just appeared they wanted to get him out into open space and try and get him the football. As you mentioned, unable to connect. Vic with the incompletion on first down, and now that leads to second and ten. Vic readies to throw. He lets this one fall toward the back of the end zone. I don't understand. My guys don't probably understand those. against him the rest of the game. But on that last one, that worked quite well for the defense. They come up to the line now, facing a third and ten after the incompletion. 
Off the play fake, Mick. That might be the third down stuff that they needed because they've had a lot of trouble slowing down this offense in the first half. This might be their opportunity to get off the field. The three straight incompletions, they don't care. That hasn't dissuaded them. They're going to go for it on four. They'll try and throw for it here. Nicked off by Divine Diablo. Throw Charles over the middle of the field. Get him out of too many bodies in there. Got picked. That's a, it's a normal situation, too, isn't it? No matter how far you try to spread the field sometimes, there's always going to be a traffic jam, it feels like, towards the middle. And if there's any type of a missed throw, or maybe the ball's tipped, or just too many bodies in the area, an interception can result. On first down, push. You lose a yard there, and it's second and 11. Extra tight ends, extra beef, they want to run the football. That means if I want to run it inside, if you get strung out on the perimeter, you're bad. And we saw the result. Here's a throw to his running back. It's complete. Frank Price attacking him on the run. And he's going to get this one down to the edge of the red zone. A big play that time on the catch and run. A lot of times the key is just get him the ball, let him do his thing, and they got it out to him on the left side. And he did exactly that. So I brought back to the catch. They'll run on first down. It's Bush. And a tackle made by Andrew Wiggers. And we've hit the two minute mark in this first half of action. Throwing on second and eight, Fields. And it falls to the ground to lead. Nice job of bodying him up defensively. And now it brings up third down. It's just the amount of times he drops those. So the failure to connect on second down, that leaves him staring up here for the third and eight. Now Fields. Open hands, that's an easy motion. And he was going to be at the 12, short of the first down. But he gets seven there, but he brings up fourth. But Kevin Stefanski going to take a chance going for it on four. They snap it to Fields. Flushed out running. And that's going to be caught. Thanks, man. I think my desk's a little broke from your early interceptions, but. decision to go for it. He's off six points. Coaches must really like to see that from the quarterback. He's had the interceptions in this game, but they're able to connect on the touchdown pass. Well, they're going to have to see that because they had a turvy game and they come back and they miss taxes, right? They miss making plays, but the spotlight is magnified on your quarterback. And when he stands up to the pressure and comes back and throws a touchdown pass after throwing some picks earlier, they feel great about that guy. And likewise for him personally, as a rookie quarterback, has to give him more confidence. And he'll get it up just past the 20 as his guys will go to work at the 21 yard line. Did you just say battle kids? The Tampa offense ready to get their drive started. Still more than a minute to go, so yeah, there is time if they want to mount something here. Not only time. They have three timeouts at their disposal as well, so that changes everything that you're doing here. Without those timeouts, you can only work the sides on the team to get out of bounds. Here, the middle of the field is still available because you can call timeout and regroup. Vic with the incompletion on first down, and now that leads to second and ten. Oh, to throw, Vic. Flush to his right. 
attempts to chip the game. They do get a couple, but they'll be left staring at a third and eight coming up. I think you would agree. Just a good decision right there. Goes for the safe play. Gets some yardage out of it. And showed some toughness as well. As you noted, he stayed right in there. Soft rush was coming. Hung in there. Took the hit. Dumped it out to the outside. And now they pick up some yardage. And you have to back this grateful to you. And we'll continue to make plays. Thus far, they've been able to move the line of scrimmage very well in the running game. Almost felt like they said in the huddle. Can you guys pass protect? Let's take a big shot downfield. Didn't get it on that one, but they may come back to it again. And no move to get the offense off the field. Despite failing once, they're going to go again here on fourth down. They will indeed go for it. Vic. And he's brought down. Can't do anything with a football. It's a sack and a turnover on downs. Boy, a curious decision to go for it. Doesn't pan out. And now possession will go over inside the 15-yard line. Now a first and 10 at the 11. Here's Fields. And this is caught. Touchdown. Pat Fryermuth there to make the grab. And the Browns are an extra point away from the ball game here in the final minute of the first half. Extra point by Anderson up and good. And we are tied here in the second quarter. I forgot I made this so emo transmog. Oh, hold on. Oh shit, you know why? Because at some point I threw my fucking What's up man dude? I missed sorry I didn't see you man. I gotta fix it more in a second. At some point I threw my hat at the screen because I was mad and I fucked up the camera. <laughs> How's that? Is that better? I think that's the right spot. <laughs> Sorry, man. The box offense set to begin their next possession. Man, I've had some major explosions in this game, anger wise. I can't believe that I actually have come back tied it. I think it was 21 to nothing at one point. But it certainly made a point of getting him involved in the passing game here in the first half. It must have seen something in the scouting that said, hey, we can capitalize on him getting the ball, possibly in the open field. And I think in the second half, that may loosen up the defense a little bit to get the running game going back inside. It's a play fake. Now Vic. That one caught by Tyree Hill. And brought down the Vanessa Field reaching the 45 yard line. Now the Bucks going to use the first of their timeouts. As the stoppage will come with 23 seconds to go till halftime. Back to back, good plays. Have them on the move on first down. Goes play action. Being chased out wide. Looking downfield to Godwin. What? What was that animation? Gonna go ahead and use the second of their Holy shit, dude, I am completely clipping this. That is some shit I've never seen before. No. Yeah, they get, yeah. Either way, that's a make right that's gotta be. Oh, ooh, nice. That's a make right that's gonna have to make the internet, because that shit was awesome. <laughs> No, he like, it was like a mix between two of them. He one-handed it and did like the big hop thing. Like, I've never seen that. Ah, nice son, nice son. I don't know how to stop those. If it gets to one yard, I don't have a defense to stop the QB sneak. So, 
just extends the point. If he can't stop taking care of it, get to the locker room with the lead. Yeah, I usually do too, unless, I don't know, there's, there's a difference in... in players like if i can actually get away and cover the inside guy then at least i have enough to cover two of them and i can handle them sometimes but then i'll get lost like if somebody's doing running in between i'll get lost and trying to stop the run then they'll cross there's over my head and shit all right seven seconds huh see if we can throw Yeah. I had the opposite yesterday. I had somebody who ran a power running game nonstop, but didn't stop even when they were losing. Like, they couldn't score. And they just kept all game, all to like the last second of the game. I won twenty eight nothing, but they just ran all game. I don't know what they were expecting. I don't know if they were. They could have just been testing and like, hey, I'm gonna commit to the run all game and see if I can figure out identifying Mike will fix something or who knows. <laughs> Yeah. Oh shit, nice. I've got a couple of those I've got a couple of those like crazy Hail Marys that I've snipped that actually worked out for me. Ooh. Good hit. Uh, 98, it's a, it's a four-way theme team, 25 of 25 on, uh, four different AFC teams. Yeah, it's Browns, Dolphins, Broncos, and Titans. Hey, that's... You're no money spent, though, right? Oh, wow. I wasn't watching your blitz at all. I have to do this. That's a 10 yard line. I can't give you the ball. Yeah. Yeah, I I I'm almost no money spent on this guy. It's I the only thing I bought was I bought a bunch of the special packs that they actually give you for leveling and then in the Super Bowl week because I moved over from next gen, from current gen PC to this on um Super Bowl week. Second. I bought the Super Bowl tree thing that like, like ended up being a hundred bucks or something. Oh shit! Yeah, I didn't. I've never played much. I haven't played Madden in years. This is. I started in November on PC. It's my first time ever playing Madden online at all. I enjoy it. So I'm dealing with an addiction level that most people got over with years ago. But I'm content creating now for it. And, you know, we got a group of people. We make, like, coin-making videos. We make no-money-spent videos. We do a bunch of shit like that. So it's become pretty fun. Oh, that's a bad click on school. Oh, 
Oh, I saw that hole open. Yeah, so the thing is, like, I, I've only... I don't care what anybody does. I The only things that get me mad are... I hate somebody that does a celebration run when what they did wasn't skillful. And I know that sounds so dickery, but, like, if you're... If, like, like that, I no, no, that right there. My fucking inside guy didn't move. I have no clue why. He just stood still. He got glitched out. That shit happens in the middle of the field. Somebody gets a 20 yard touchdown, and then they fucking celebration run in. Then I get mad. That's the toxic shit I get mad about, which I shouldn't, but I do. Yeah. Yeah, that's that's the... Yeah, I've gotten a bunch of that too. I did that to somebody and my wife was in here laughing because it t turned into that guy and racial slurs and a whole bunch of other shit that I just could not understand. Oh, shit. No. Oh. You, by sacking me, saved me an interception because I did not see your lurking guy in your zone, and I would have completely thrown the interception there. So thank you. This way. Browns always. I'm a, I'm a Cleveland Browns fan. What's up? Yeah, I live in Cleveland. Nice. Whereabouts? Oh, nice, man. Where do you live now? Ah, uh, gotcha. Yeah, my wife is uh, from was born in Gary and lived most of her life in New Carlisle. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, she made it out of the murder capital. She's alive. You are not hood as fuck. Shut up back there. I could tell my wife to shut up while I'm streaming. It's totally okay. I'm not going to get canceled. You just screamed I'm hood as fuck. So from Buccaneer territory now, Regardless of the... Let's see how long I'm going to get for getting into whatever it's going to get. Okay, don't be loud, though. I'm streaming. Here's Fields. What's that? Do you glitch? Oh, yeah, 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 yeah. Actually, I'm using Restream, so I stream to all... Uh, I stream to Twitch, YouTube, Facebook, and Twitter all at the same time. Yep, except for no underscore TTV. Thanks, man. I appreciate that. Yeah, it's definitely not nice to not play a douche, <laughs> to be honest with you. Or not even a douche so much, just... Nice not to play one of the toxic thirteen-year-olds. Like, that's just hard to. It's hard to deal with. And if I keep dinking and dunking here, I'm gonna have no chance at this game. I'm gonna do something more than four yards. Nope, he's past you. Touchdown. Oh. 
Oh, you wait and you got to be, ex well, I would say you were excited and for the golden tickets, but Lord, they're not going to let us have any of them. I mean, that, you know Mike Evans got a golden ticket, right? The safety card. Well, I think they'll at least at some point give you the ability to win, to pick one of them in solos. It'll happen in a month or so, so hopefully by the time they do that, just wait to play them until they release that Mike Evans because that Mike Evans is going to become endgame. That Mike Evans and the Teddy Hendricks safety should be the middle two safeties for almost everybody. Yeah. Yeah, the Vita Vea is, is going to be a pain in the ass to play. To play against. I kind of thought about that Mike Evans at receiver just because he's 6'5 and big. Yeah, babe. The... Yeah. Yeah, but those ones are pretty easy to do if you build sets and resell them. So, like, I got a bunch of content that actually. Ooh, pick! I got a bunch of content that'll help you with coins and, uh,. When you make sure you friend me when you follow me on uh, Twitter, I'll give you a little preview of what's coming out. I've been building a website with the uh, I'm a developer by trade. Um, I've been building a website with kind of the group that we're on Discord with and we do all the streaming stuff with, and it basically has every card and every current price and every set. And um, no, 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 I didn't want him to do that, because I knew he would fumble. Just go. Oh, and I got it. Holy shit. I hate, that's the one animation I hate when Fields does, is he tries to fight for an extra yard, and he fumbles it almost every time when he does that. And this was much funner with the skate bars. Anyway, the site I'm building, I've built... All the way back to team of the year, every set, it looks at every price, it looks at every card on the market, and then it tells you which sets you can just go out and buy the pieces for to make profit right now. Like, pure profit, not not after you trade it profit. Um, and the site is mutttools.com. You won't be able to you won't be able to create a login yet because it's uh I've got login I've got account creation turned off until I finish it. But very, very soon. Oh, god damn it, the fucking backside pursuit. So I had him, but the problem is because I've always had Dallas or Denver in my uh, theme team, like, I have a plethora of rushers, so I just went back since I'm running three tight ends to Friar Moose. Okay, we're we're a gambler. We're gonna go for two. Whoa! What a horrible, horrible pass. I know he was under pressure, but horrible. 
fuck. All right. Well, well. Let's see if we can get it. Uh, hi, baby. All right. Oh no no no! Yeah. Oh shit! AJ, say hi. So say sup fool. No, no, say sup fool. Good job. That's good enough. Okay, wait, wait, you can't climb on top of me right now, homie. Seriously, no, AJ. Mom, I need help. This is a very important game right now. This is my whole season. Oh no 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 stop. And he fumbled it! Okay, well, alright. Good job, good hit stick, good game. That was an ex Dude, that was one of the most exciting weekend league games I've played in a while. Oh no, man! I always, I generally get about 10, 10, uh, 10 wins in, and this week it's, I'm probably tracking to do the same. I have a hard time playing against the, the. I've got it doesn't. But, um, I got a hard time playing against the the kids that run the YouTube offenses real well. And intercept me every time I throw it. I'm working on it. I'm, I'm working. I know. No, not sneeze. Slime. Awesome lurks, man. Let me uh, I'll drop you a follow too. A B C D E F G. Let me get channel going on. You got food going on, baby? Down. Okay. You want down? Yeah. Okay. All right. Let's get in and follow Night. back real quick. Night. See ya. Love you. Hello. Let me hop to my screen, man. I keep forgetting about the Friday night, Friday three packs. Hey, Mom. Hey, Mom. Oh, Mom. Oh, Mom. There we go. There's the. Okay, follow back. Follow back. There we go. All right. Yeah, man. You know what? I I was that way at the beginning, lurks, and and I enjoy it now. Um, I think it makes everybody think I'm a little crazy because sometimes I have no viewers in here, and I'm talking to the computer like I do have viewers. Um, but besides that, uh, I've really enjoyed. Generally, have people be coming and content uh, comment on my stuff. What happened, Bubba? Uh, Normally, I only stream later after the kids go to bed, but we have a weird because of Mother's Day. We have a weird timing situation going on, so all the kids are up. I haven't put this one to bed yet. Can you not pull your diaper down on camera? I got poop. That'd be nice. I just changed it. No, you don't got poop. You got wet. There you go. It's all better. Um, um, thank you, thank you, for, thank you for num num numbing me. What's up, Iceman Cash? Seven four five. Do you, hey, hey, do you run the two four five defense? Hey, right. don't play with the boxes, please. Why? Because I said so. Those aren't yours. Those are not even yours. Those are your brothers. Hey, hey. 
Don't touch them. No. 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 Hey, don't talk back. Why did it? Are you drinking milk or did you find some milk? This is, oh, is that cream cheese all over his face? Okay. Alright. Let's see if we can get on a winning streak here. That would be nice. Iceman Cash, if you just want to, you know, out of the goodness of your heart and sportsmanship, want to let me win, that's okay. Alright, fine. We'll play a nice, fair game, and then at the end, then you can just let me win, because I'm a great guy. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. You did just set a record, though. You and the last guy played made two non douches in a row, and I don't think I've ever played two people in a row where both were not douchebags. That is, this is a record. It's to be celebrated. Yeah, there are times where. I know it's going to be bad, so I just turn off the whole audio from the controller, and then I just play. Like, that way, I don't have to get mad at the kids. Hey, guys, no yelling. Baby, okay. They had the incomplete pass on second down. Now they need a big play here, third and ten. From the gun, Jackson, and he'll be hit as he releases it. Oh, is that what your plan is? That you want to steal that twenty bucks and get sheets? You want to go sheets? Well, there's no other place for sandwiches besides sheets, would be my guess. I do know how you feel about the hot sauce. That is true. Okay, look at this. The punt team nowhere to be found. They're on the sidelines. They'll indeed go for it with Jackson. I don't care what they do, unless they, because now that there's not a uh, golden ticket for a right or left end, even though it doesn't really matter because golden tickets are garbage, They're, they've ruined the game almost for me by making them so hard to get, but uh, I, I don't know that Randy Gregory is ever going to leave my team. He is so good off the edge. Uh, I mean, I, 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 I don't know. I haven't played that Lawrence Taylor. I did pull one, but I sold him. Um, it's hard because he's at the right outside linebacker. I would bring him in at right outside linebacker if, uh, if I could, but he just doesn't fit. This is a really difficult theme team. It's four teams, each from an AFC division, and all uh, 25 of 25. So, like, it was a, ooh, ooh, that's a, not a touchdown. Um, so, yeah, it's four teams, 25 of 25 each. So, it's a 100 of 100 theme team. It's hard to fit people in that don't fit on the theme team. But, maybe if this goes away, uh, putting him on the far edge... If they make any way for us to get golden tickets, I'll probably break the theme team to make a better team, but we'll see. They snap it to Fields, escaping the pressure right. And that's going to be caught for a Browns touchdown. This is hard, though. I just turned off Escape Artist the other day, and I'm so used to playing this particular offense 
with escape artists that I'm getting sacked a lot. I did say sacked, baby. It's an adult male word. We can have phallic words with each other. Kind of. It's kind of phallic. Well, I guess it's not phallic. It's male genitalia. Yes, you are! You can't make fun of the word sacked and then say you said sack and then say I was talking about football. You're full of shit. <laughs> no. The stream will judge you. My wife is in the background talking shit right now so that I get mad at the game and turn it off and we go to get sheets faster. Sandwiches. Uh, I wouldn't judge anything by the first one yet. It really do it does depend on whether or not you can handle pressure out of uh, four three six one. If you can handle the pressure, it becomes a harder game for me. Oh, baby! <laughs> Hey, babe, because this guy is nice and talking to me, I gotta pick a different defense because I would keep smoking him with this one and I feel bad. So I have to pick a shittier defense so that I'm a nicer guy. I have some, see? Oh, 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 oh. I haven't decided whether to leave that guy in. He's so funny because he's so small, but he's so fast. <laughs> Baby, he's like a hundred. It's Billy Johnson. He's a hundred. He's hundred. <laughs> Baby, settle down. He's a hundred and seventy pounds at defensive tackle, but he's got ninety-seven speed. <laughs> Baby. He is super fast, and he seems to shed a lot. Um, and I haven't really seen him getting his, his ass handed to him uh, in the running game yet because he's a run stopper at 170 pounds, which it just doesn't make any sense, but it works. At this point of the season, do you still enjoy uh, playing Madden Ice Man? Gotcha. I'm pretty. It's actually the only game I'm playing too on it. I do have a couple of other games. Like I started with with uh, the NBA 2K21, but I didn't buy the newer one. And then uh, I didn't. I chose not to buy the MLB The Show just because I don't know. It seems like it'll be a little boring. I'm really enjoying Madden right now, even with the season coming to an end. Yeah. There's, um, it's the only thing I'm jealous about Xbox for. Like, I don't ever want to be Xbox, but the only thing I'm jealous is the Xbox Game Pass get got MLB The Show Day Zero for free and got Madden Day Zero for free on the regular subscription price. 
So at least, without spending 70 bucks on the game, if you wanted to go play around with MLB Show a little bit, you could. Oh my god, no, Tim Patrick, you've got to go. i got to change my lineup. I can no longer be Tim Patrick. I like him, but you got to fight a little harder than that. And I forget that that's Tim Patrick because he has the same number as Calvin Johnson. I have to go change him in my actual team makeup. So I stop forgetting. Yeah, Tim, pa look, Tim Patrick, look, he's 6'4", he's 99 speed. He, he's good. He just doesn't animate for me the same way that Calvin Johnson or Randy Johnson do. I mean, Randy Moss do, and I have them both, so you might, I might as well play somebody who animates just a little better. I really can't explain why. Yeah, and I like the fact that he became, like, he's kind of a secret. A lot of people weren't running Tim Patrick until his team captain card came out. He's like a secret 6-4 guy. The Bears offense ready to go for their next drive. They've shown precious little here offensively thus far as they try again with a first down now. Here's Jackson. Oh, both your guys stop. Oh, 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 oh. oh no. And this is going to be intercepted. Picked off by the Pro Bowl safety cam chancellor. And the Browns are going to get the football back at their own 17. Is that the high level uh Tyreek Hill? There can be a tendency there to try and get it all back in one fell swoop, and that time that thinking leads to an interception. So that's a 99 overall one from Madden Machines or whatever. Because you try and force plays, right? You try and get all back in one shot, just as you mentioned there, and you know you're gonna need some big plays to get to the message somewhere. You really can't force what isn't there. Oh, there he is. Oh shit. Now a first down throw fields. Over the middle complete. It's Bush. Just a leave him a yard short. Nice pickup of nine yards on first down. Just about every quarterback is trained to really look downfield first before you come back and make a nice safe throw. And in this case, that's exactly what he did. He running back, let him create some space, and it turned out to be a nice play for the offense. Two minutes to play, first half, it's 14 to nothing. Don't you come shoot to me. We remind you in just a couple of minutes, we'll get you to Orlando and our good friend Jonathan Coachman. Coach will run through some of the numbers and the next-gen stats from this first half of football so far. Again, this is Bush. Give it. And he'll get it up to the 33 yard line. They were not fooling around at all, were they? Second and short, and they brought out the heavy package. Almost like the super heavy package against that defense, didn't it? I, mean, I don't think they expected that much beef up front, and it turned into an easy first down conversion. On first down, Fields. Complete to New oh, back. A good rally to the football keeps him to only a yard, and it's second down. Not a big window to throw. Coverage wasn't too bad there. Yeah, they had him under wraps pretty well, but somehow able to muscle his way open and catch the ball. Here's second and nine. Now Fields. Eluding the pressure right. And that is caught. It's Davis. And he's able to get this to the 40-yard line before he's out of bounds. 
Look like defense, but pretty good. Are you switching again, Madden dude? Sorry, I'm talking to somebody on stream real quick. Are you switching again, Madden dude? I thought you switched out of the Bills theme team. I thought you went Titans. Oh, deep route. Oh, oh, oh. Roquan Smith wasn't having it. That's old Patty Fryer move. Oh, 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 no yell. Hey, Landon, no yelling out there. Yeah, his uh, his season three card is really, really good. I know everybody likes the Davenport, but I'm not um, because this theme team has the Broncos on it and the Browns. It gives me and the Titans, it gives me a whole bunch of right end and left end rushers. So there just wasn't room to also keep Davenport. So I switched back to Friar Muth. I don't know, man, dude. I don't know if the Bills theme team is all that it's all that OP. I don't see a lot of people playing it. Like who are your big you don't have super tall receivers. You don't have super great cornerbacks. Like, who's the... I mean, I, I guess you get Reggie Bush, and you get Josh Allen if you want a strong-arm quarterback. But if you happen to land one of the golden tickets, you're not going to run Josh Allen. I just don't know what the power is in that particular theme team. You do get stuff on digs, right? Oh, okay. Okay. Oh, backyard ballers. I thought you were saying BB as in Buffalo Bills. Oh, if I would have missed that. Ooh. Almost got mossed by Monster. Yeah. So you're building the whole backyard ballers theme team, man, dude? Like the one that they were running when the promo was hot? Final play of the half here. It's Jackson. He's gonna go up top again. Oh, Moss. Picked off at the twenty five. Oh, he breaks a tackle and he's got an alley. And he will be brought down. Who do you like better, Moss or Calvin Johnson? If both of them are 99 speed. So two quarters down, two remain. Charles and I return after the break. And we welcome you back. Just that one extra height and, and the physicalness. Oh, 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 and it's not letting me call the timeout. I'll be sleeping. Oh, that's nice, man, dude. Yeah, I've been holding on to him ever since the promo. I love that card. They're talking about Jimmy Smith and the promo uh, from the Backyard Bottlers promo, who is just... One of the best sub linebackers in the game right now. Jimmy Smith, the out of position guy from. Uh, oh, God. I tried to play it, didn't work. Uh, the out of position safety from the Saints. He's uh, 6'7 and 99 speed on most. Uh, I don't think he's 99. I think he's 98 speed on most theme teams. Clock management here on out. 
No, he's a he's a strong safety, but if you run nickel, you throw him in the you throw him in the sub linebacker spot. So he comes in instead of having your middle linebacker, so come in for them as safety. Touchdown earlier, nearly a second one there. Yeah, it took a touchdown saving tackle to keep him out of the end zone after a big play. Perhaps you go right back to him. Don't need the distance, but maybe he can pay things off after a big effort. And he is into the end zone. Touchdown, Cleveland. Reggie Bush. All right, man. Well, listen, it was a fun it was a fun game, fun conversation. Feel free to hop over. My uh, Twitter name is the same, just without the underscore TTV, and hop in, man. We got a really good community. People help people. We do coin making. We do all that stuff. Yep, just take out the underscore TTV at the end. It's just Lord Oxide. All right, I'll see you, man. Oh, All right. Okay, guys, I'm going to have to, uh, man, dude, I'm going to have to hop out for a bit. Um, we'll go raid somebody. Maybe I'll be back on. Actually, I think this will be it for tonight. It's Mother's Day. I'm going to go put the kids to sleep, and I think me and the wife, unless she really wants to play her game, uh, unless she really wants to play WoW, we'll probably go watch some ozarks or something tonight for mother's day you know we'll get a little handsy in the bedroom yeah. all right let's see who we can raid real quick let's see who we got on we got kicks is on he's playing rust though I don't have anybody streaming things. So I guess we're just going to go to kicks for a little bit. All right. So you want me to take the baby to bed and then you're going to run and go get stuff? Huh? Well, you call it you call it swollen. I call it adolescent. 